Yeah. yeah. That's, that's right. I've been uh, a Paiste artist since 2010. This, this extra dry ride, it's a 22. This is one of my Paiste symbols of the day. And this Masters, this 20 inch thin Masters, this is my other Paiste symbol of the day. What I love about Paiste is um, it's got a rich tradition decades of making in incredible instruments. Like the cymbals, the, the, the variety of sounds and colors and textures and the versatility, not only of the different lines of cymbals, but also within one specific line of cymbal. You know, I feel pretty comfortable with most of the different lines of Paiste cymbals playing them on any kind of a gig. My current Paiste setup, uh, I'm using the Formula 602s. Um, I have, I'm using kind of a, kind of a mixed batch. Um, I've also got a PST, 17-inch PST, uh, and a 16-inch Signature Crash as well. Uh, but I've got a couple of Dark Energies. I've got a 20-inch Dark Energy ride that I love. Uh, and also uh, a 20, uh, the 20 series, 18-inch Crash. Well, I chose these two Paiste symbols, um, the, the 20 inch thin masters and also the uh, 22 extra dry masters um, because you were nice enough to let me try to because I couldn't choose one. But what I love especially uh, about this, the thin crash is it's really dark, but it's super rich. Like it's got a nice attack, but it's also got a nice, um, a wide um, example of overtones. And this, th this thing, is like, I've never heard a symbol like this. It was truly one of the most unique symbols I've ever heard in my life. And it initially struck me like something that I know that I would use consistently, both in a rock setting because it's really dry and has a great attack, but also in a jazz setting for the, almost the exact same reasons. So these are my two Paiste crashes of the day. Thank you.